All right, got her going. So first, I'm gonna take a peek here what's going out in my solar setup here. I think it's gonna be calling for some uh, revamping. Bought these at Harbor Freight. And my feeling is that something has come disconnected. Yeah, I don't think I don't think this is producing power anymore. Uh, all the indicators are off. And uh I think it is done. Well, it can do. So, I'll probably tear this down and try to rescue what I can from it. But it was kind of, you know, cheap crap anyway. Got seven years out of it. It was saving me about 30 bucks a month in electric. <coughs> so, I figured it saved me probably about $2,500. I I probably had about a thousand in it, so I'm still 1,100 ahead of it. What I'll do is when I get a new roof put on the house, I'll put the real panels on there and have it done professional. My wife and I were talking about whether we were going to stay or move again, and as usual. During the winter, the, the urge to leave gets stronger, but then come spring and summertime, we kind of like where we're at. So, it's kind of one of those conflicts you have to work out because it is a buyer's, you know, it's a seller's market right now. <clears throat> Probably get really good money for our place and but then on the other hand, I just picked up a new job, which is close to home and got really good benefits. So that's the case. I really wouldn't want to be doing anything for another three or four years anyway. So that's a dilemma we're on. Yeah, I mean, we'll call it a dilemma. It's conversation. And Probably good things that we have them from time to time. You know, out here in central Illinois, we, we do enjoy some of the places that we go to and some of the people we meet. But then again, we could probably find those places in other states also. But we'll see what happens. So, oh boy, there's a big old toad there. Actually, the ones that make all that noise are not that big, but they make a lot of noise. We're going to see what sort of wildlife we we catch on this walk. And to keep the upload down to, you know, half a day, I'll do this in a couple parts. So this is part one, where I mess with the solar array and seeing that it's pretty much, it, it's dead. So I'm going to scrap that system. The next one I do will be a lot closer to the house. <clears throat> It'll be roof mounted. But that project will happen probably next year. 
I do get a lot of sunlight, so solar is the way to go. So, this will be part one, and then I'll start part two later.